They may not be calling it a new tax, but a bill making its way through the state Senate would put craft brewers at odds with their distributors, forcing them and ultimately patrons to pay more. The Senate Rules Committee cast a 9-4 vote yesterday in favor of a bill that would require craft brewers to buy back their products from distributors before they could sell them in their tasting rooms. Local brewers say with canning and bottling machines on site, they would be paying a 30% markup on beer that never even left the brewery. The law would only apply to breweries that sell 2,000 or more kegs a year, and beer makers like Sarasota's Big Top Brewery say they put out at least seven times that amount. The tasting room numbers for the production and for the draft sales are a key part of how we plan our, our projections and our revenue uh, and the cost for the brewery. So adding additional 30% onto that, it's definitely going to be difficult for us to do. When we start out with this, our distributors are partner. Um, so we have to kind of play the grounds where we understand that they're in this to make money and that we're in this to make money and that they're businesses. So coming to a common ground is going to be something that we're excited to do. And craft brewers have been at odds with lawmakers over a number of issues, including the size of the growler, which they're bottles that can sell in the tasting room. The Senate bill is, about, is, is moving towards a floor vote and similar bill is on the House Budget Subcommittee.